Beaumont police credit one woman's curiosity with drawing their attention to a fake business operated by a sex offender accused of taking pictures of would-be models. KFTM reporter Justin Hinton investigates the case and how police used a sting operation to catch the suspect. Investigators say John Dagree would meet women at a local hotel, take their pictures for what he described as a modeling assignment, and interview them for what police call his fake business. Pastry on wheels. According to the site, the MCM Elegante served as at least one of the meeting locations. Investigators would not confirm whether it was the location for an undercover operation last Friday to catch Degree in action. The area hotel that he went to, uh, yes, people did uh, go and apply. Uh, I don't believe that he got the response that he expected and there were people that had made appointments that uh, thought better of it and did not keep their appointments, but uh, there were people that went to the uh, appointment. This is one way he caught women's attention through his website, pastryonwheels.com. A concerned citizen saw that website, they called police, and that sparked the investigation. When we started digging, there was, n there was nothing to back the company up. Lieutenant Karen Froman says people were applying for jobs through Degree's fake company. Posted requirements just part of the process of making his business seem legitimate. It's very elaborate, I, I must say, but that doesn't mean uh, there are smart people out there that do elaborate things all the time. But she says with the help of a curious woman who looked at the web page. An applicant became suspicious and checked the sex offender database. They were able to begin the process of shutting down Degree and sending him to jail. In Beaumont, Justin Hinton, KFDM 6 News. Officers arrested Degree on a motion to revoke probation for a previous sex crime. Lieutenant Froman says you should always check out companies when you apply for a job. She says if something looks suspicious, call police.